Hi guys, Brock here with Volkswagen of Puyallup. I just wanted to show you the 2023 Volkswagen Atlas. This is our full size edition of the uh, vehicle. You also have another option called the Cross Sport. It's gonna have the same features as this, but it's gonna be minus a rear uh, third row seat and you're gonna have a little bit more of a sloped um, rear hatch in order to provide for a little bit more of a sporty look. You're gonna have the same size 20 inch rims as this one has here. You uh, go from 20 inch rims here, this is going to be the SEL edition rim that comes with this car. This is gonna be one of the top of the line vehicles that we offer. You've got your IQ lighting system here, which allows the lights to look around corners. You also have intelligent crash response in the IQ system as well. This is, like I said, a 2023 SEL edition. That means you're gonna have heated seats, you're gonna have a heated steering wheel in this vehicle, you're gonna have a sunroof as well, and you have these roof rails on top of it in order to put any accessories on it you might want. And Volkswagen offers a huge array of accessories currently for these vehicles. Looking into it in the back back here, you'll, you'll, <laughs> you'll notice that the uh, car has the captain's chairs configuration. This configuration allows for a little bit more access to the third row back here. And this particular vehicle comes in the, the brown interior and there's not a lot of these available. Most of these are gonna come in black. So if you want something specific, make sure you check the box of the brown interior. Another one of my favorite features about these vehicles and one of my favorite features uh, amongst all my clients on these cars is the ability to put up the uh, rear screen back there. You got a lot of kids nowadays and or passengers nowadays that are either doing business or they're playing on their tablets. They don't want glare, they don't want sun, they don't want to look over and see somebody staring into the window of their car. And this just allows for a little bit more privacy. And uh, we've had a lot of clients be very, very happy with these features. As you come around the rear end of this vehicle, you'll notice that it is the SEL trim and the four motion denotes that it's all wheel drive. Now this particular version of the vehicle comes in a 2.0 engine. We also offer a 3.6 liter V6. The 3.6 is good for 5,000 pounds of towing while the 2.0 is good for 2,000 pounds of towing. Back here you have a really cool feature. These are the cargo blocks features. Now this is one of my favorite things about Volkswagen. It's very simple but very straightforward thinking which is something that the engineers at Volkswagen are very well known for. These cargo blocks right here are Velcro on the bottom, and this back mat is a Velcro loop system. So you basically can set these up any way you want, and it makes it so your groceries don't slide around in the back, or if you need to have some sort of uh, equipment or gear not be sliding around in the back, you can keep it within those cubbies. Now the full-size spare tire is a nice thing to have, and it also is built into the safety features of the vehicle, where if you do end up in a rear impact accident, the tire absorbs a lot of this impact and makes the forces go around the outside of the vehicle, keeping your passengers safe. Now you'll see that you can fold down these rear seats, allowing for even more cargo space. And these vehicles are set up for a lay flat design. Now lay flat design makes it so that you can take this car out and use it as a tent if you want to go camping in it. And as you come in here to the rear of the vehicle, you'll notice that you have your independent climate control for your rear passengers. They can also be controlled by, let's say the parents or whoever's driving up front if they wanna override this. They just sync the entire vehicle up to whatever the temperature is from the front. You also have a cool ability to access your full on house plug, which is 115 volts. You have the ability to charge via um, USB and then in the back back here, the rear occupants have their own USB chargers as well as an additional 12 volt. So everybody in the car can be on their own independent devices. Nobody ever has to worry about chargers and nobody has to argue over cords or anything like that anymore. We have something for everyone. Now, one thing I wanted to show you folks is I am six foot one, okay? A lot of people say there's no rear space in these vehicles. Whether you have it in the bench configuration or whether you have it in the captain's uh, chair configuration, this uh, seat will be able to slide forward and I can sit in it pretty much all the way forward. In a perfect world, I'd slide it back maybe an inch or two, but you'll notice that I have plenty of space to sit in here like this. Somebody who's 6'2", 6'1", can also sit in the driver's seat very comfortably still. 
like this. Now let me show you the third row. Everybody says it doesn't look like there's enough space back there, but I'm proving you wrong right now. So guys, yeah, we, we took it on a road trip recently. We had one manager up front, six foot three, another manager back here, six foot two, and then myself as well, six foot two. I have four, five inches right here of plenty of space. As you go through the menu on these vehicles, there's quite a bit of option. You're gonna have the ability to use either Android Auto or Apple CarPlay via App Connect. And now, between 22 and 23, they've become a wireless connection. So it's really cool to just be able to do this wirelessly and no longer have a cord connecting you to either your Apple CarPlay or your Android Auto. You also have your uh, wireless phone charging. So basically, we've eliminated the need for wires up front. But in case you do need to charge your phone manually, you do still have two USBs as well as a 12 volt charging port. So thanks for tuning in today, guys. Make sure you uh, like uh, the link below and subscribe to our channel for any uh, information in the future that you might be looking for. We're gonna be doing this frequently and we look forward to helping you out in the future.